vital lines, eight man panic, and the war machine is ready for battle. I'm ready to fight for the career of George the Hitman Julio. Fifty years of wrestling experience will be destroyed by Des Alexander, James Jackson, and the rest of the clowns who are trying to retire such a great man. He does. Hey, it is not to be his destiny. That's why the SOH got involved in this. That's right, Des Alexander. They say that you have received a sign from the Greek gods that you're going to have a great victory. Well, I got news for you, Tess Alexander. The war machine doesn't believe in your gods. The war machine believes in Soviet firepower. And that's what I have here. And that's what I'm going to bring, Tess Alexander. And when I've got you down on the mat, and James Jackson is trying to bomb down on me from the top rope, he's gone to the top and he's trying to bomb down. I'm going to catch him. And I'm going to pick up James Jackson above my head as the world trembles beneath my legs. I'm going to bomb him down. And when he is bombed down on the ground, I'm gonna stand on his head. That's right, I'm going to do a Russian march on James Jackson's head for ever putting the idea into the Glenroy fans' heads. Heads that the war machine is not a threat. The war machine is the ultimate threat in Australian wrestling. It doesn't matter what arena. It doesn't matter what street. It doesn't matter whatever platform. The war machine is the one that can destroy everyone. That is right. I can destroy everyone. And that's Alexander. You better pray for your gods to accept you into their kingdom. Because after next Saturday night, when George the Hitman goes home and celebrates his victory, you but the one he about to be accepted into Olympus. Good luck with that, Felicia.